Okay, so you're trying to figure out if you should buy Chandler David Smith's real estate investing course or potentially any real estate course online. That describes you, you've come to the right video. We're gonna cover everything you need to know about Chandler's course in this video, as well as a couple other alternatives. So the major question everyone has before they buy a course is, is this actually going to help me? I can not say that the information in Chandler's course really clarified a lot of misconceptions I had about real estate and helped me take the first steps. I'm a brand new real estate investor, so his explanations were really helpful in getting me over that first initial hump of learning everything. I'm actually under contract for my first property right now and Chandler's course was part of the process in helping me have the confidence to move forward on that first deal. So the whole goal of the program is to get you from zero to 100 doors of rental real estate, which is pretty impressive. In this video, we're gonna cover the anatomy of Chandler's course, the strongest pros about his course, the worst cons, and then we're gonna rate the course based on our community members' rankings in addition to our objective view here at Course Ranks. At the end, we're gonna cover alternatives to the course and their prices. So make sure you stick around for that. So one more thing before we get into it, guys, if at any point during this video or any of the other videos you decide you want to buy a course, make sure you go to Course Ranks first, check out the reviews, and then use the button on Course Ranks to click through to that course. We have affiliate agreements with a lot of the courses on Course Ranks, and when you buy through them, it really helps support this community and helps us bring more transparency to an industry that's plagued with false advertising and predatory marketing. Sweet, so let's dive into it. First, the cost of the course is $299, but you can get it for $199 with the code 100 off. The course platform is Podia. Total hours of video is eight hours and 48 minutes. And the type of video is just Chandler's talking head. All right, now let's go over what gets covered. So in this first section, intro to real estate investing, it talks about how to set goals and become an intentional investor and different strategies based on your stage of life, house hacking or investing, those types of things. The next section is on choosing your market. Chandler recommends buying where you live or if you live in a place like New York or California to research other places where you can cash flow as well and see appreciation on your properties. The next section is understanding your market and this Chandler talks about strategies and some pretty awesome ways to get to know a few square miles of land like the back of your hand. So this really helps you narrow down what you're looking at and choose the right deal for you in the right area. Next is financing. Chandler covers different loans here, how to shop rates and make friends with people. Then we've got the liability and LLC setup. He goes over this if you want to go that route. Next is picking a management company, how to manage that relationship. And then after that, we've got creating and finding deals. So Chandler covers building up your rep in your market. So you're getting deals fed to you right and left, which is really cool. Next is analyzing deals, how to find those really great deals. And then next is the process from putting in offers, negotiating purchase price, negotiating finance, due diligence, what to do immediately after you take ownership, and then how to manage the property effectively after that. Sweet. So now let's go into the in a nutshell section. This is where we cover what the course seller teaches in 30 seconds or less. So number one, commit to finding amazing real estate deals with a lot of cash flow as well as appreciation. Number two, work out where your market is and really understand what's going on there, what the rental market is like, and if it's a hot area. Third, decide on what your personal rule is for cash on cash return on a property. Chandler recommends 15%, 10 at the very least. Then commit to buying anything that fits those numbers. Fourth, understand all of the different levers you can pull to make a great deal make sense for you. So increasing rents, asking more money back at closing, renovations, all of those different things. Fifth, build a team of people that you can use as go-to helpers in your process. So this includes a realtor, an accountant, an insurance person, a loan officer, or a bank or credit union that's gonna help you get leverage, a management company, et cetera. Having this team makes everything in real estate investing better. So sixth, you've gotta learn how to work out great deals with all of those people that I just mentioned by showing how serious you are as an investor. And the way that you do that is by knowing your numbers and being extremely educated. And then seventh, get a management company managing your properties with great cash flow and keep scaling up. So now let's talk about the bonuses in this course. Technically, additional content is in here. It's not really a bonus, but I think maybe just stuff that he didn't know where else to fit in the course. And then the second bonus here is the spreadsheet and an app to help you evaluate deals, but those are free. You could get them just on his website or he mentions them on his YouTube channel all the time. Next, let's talk about the strongest pros. The first one is that Chandler just understands real estate. He's incredibly knowledgeable because he's done so many deals. So you're dealing with a very credible instructor here. The next one is his tips on negotiation and sales, etc., are really, really good. This is honestly super next level and it makes sense because he's made his first chunk of money that he put into real estate through a door-to-door sale. So he understands that whole side of things and he's really naturally good at it and he's actually pretty good at teaching it as well. And the next one is Chandler's really personable. This guy's honestly kind of a goofball. You just kind of feel like you're hanging out with your rich cousin or something talking real estate while you're watching the course. So that was a pro for me. The worst cons here, number one is there's almost no visual aids and very minimal edits on all the videos. So I found myself having to re-watch things because they really didn't stick with me because I felt kind of like I was in a lecture 
lecture hall sometimes. So the second con here kind of has to do with what's currently going on in the real estate market and also geographically where you're located. So Chandler lives in Idaho. He's a multimillionaire. He's in the top 1% of you know, wealth in America. And he lives in a place where you can buy, you know, a 14 plex or I don't know what he's purchased, but between like one and $3 million, which if you're located in a different area in like a major metropolitan city or anywhere on the West Coast or maybe on the East Coast, right next to the ocean there, it's gonna be really hard to find something with a purchase price that allows you to cash flow every single month. And Chandler recommends having a 15% cash on cash return on all of your properties. So he's been able to succeed in real estate because of that. He's got fat cash flow on every single property and he's got the appreciation. Whereas someone like Graham Stephan, you know, he buys and he thinks, okay, I'm just, even though I'm not cash flowing every month on this property, I'm not taking, you know, four to a thousand dollars a month out of what my renters are paying me every month and just putting it in my bank account. I'm paying probably four to a thousand dollars a month for the property. All of that is going to principal pay down and I'm actually gaining equity in the property. So someday when I sell it or, you know, I'll just have all of these assets and I'll become a multimillionaire that way. I'm not saying it's impossible to find these types of deals, but especially in the current market, market with the housing shortage, coronavirus, interest rates going up and down, the economy kind of being on the brink of maybe going up more or maybe going down. There's a lot of uncertainty and also just geographically, you might not easily be able to find deals like Chandler's talking about. Whereas in Idaho, they're much more abundant, or at least it seems like they are because of Chandler. So I guess what I'm trying to say here is if you don't have millions and millions of dollars to put into real estate and you don't live in a really cheap area, most of what Chandler's talking about might seem kind of like a daydream to you and probably would be pretty difficult to find in your area. Sweet, so now let's give Chandler his overall score. First, quality of content, we're gonna give this 4.5 out of five. It's really good stuff, it's just kind of hard to digest because of what I mentioned earlier. Secondly, credibility of instructor, I'm gonna give Chandler, I mean, a five out of five. He's done tons of real estate deals. He, I think he makes $100,000 a year just in passive income from his rental property, so that's really cool. Uh, the relevance, I'll give it a four out of five right now. That's probably gonna change in the future as the real estate market goes up and down. It's just like I mentioned, depending on where you live, it might not be that relevant to you. Next, community and support. There's absolutely no community around the course and the support I think is just Chandler replying via email or also via the like the chat widget on Podia, which I sent him something a couple days ago and I still haven't heard anything back. So I sent him, let's see, this was Wednesday evening, I believe, and it's Friday evening right now as I'm filming this. So, you know, don't expect anything super quickly from his support team, which is really just him, I think. So for the community and support, we're gonna give Chandler a 2.5 out of five. We're giving him the benefit of the doubt and assuming he will get back to me eventually. Next one is course ranks rating, which is four out of five. That's just my personal score. So people who have taken this course, definitely go review it. So that gets bumped up or down depending on how you felt about it. And the total value for price here is gonna put Chandler right at 20 out of 25, a really solid score. The main thing that hit him was not having any sort of support, which at this price point, honestly, is not very realistic. So it's not that big of a deal. Now, if you have more questions or if you're wondering if there's a better course for your situation, make sure to head over to courseranks.com and check out all the other ways to make money and all of the real estate courses available to you and the reviews on those courses. Before we close out today, let's go over the other top rated alternatives to Chandler's course. One is gonna be the Real Estate Investing and Wealth Blueprint by Graham Stephan. The next one is Cash Flow Tactics, seems to be very highly rated. It's more about how to preserve wealth through real estate and life insurance and minimize taxes and everything. So that's kind of a holistic view. Simon, he also has a $30 course bundle on some of the subjects that comes in very highly rated on course ranks as well. And of course, we have to include Meet Kevin who has two courses on real estate investing one on DIY property management, and another one from going from zero to a millionaire beyond with real estate. So make sure you head over to coreshrinks.com and check out the reviews on that one before you decide what you're gonna buy. Guys, thanks again for tuning into this video, the channel. We're so grateful to you, all of the support we've received so far. Coreshrinks is growing at an awesome rate, and we'd love to have you tell your friends. Subscribe to the channel, like the video, and make sure to check out Coreshrinks before you buy your next course. Thanks so much, and I'll see you next time.